don't know what love is. I think it might be fear. I don't know the tempo. <laughs> so this portion of the video is in prep for the next clip which will be how to make my sweet potato and butternut squash soup so um also can i just mention i can't believe we're in autumn um i started this channel in august and we're already in october it's crazy i'm definitely in the autumn vibes so um but yeah there's so much great about october obviously there's like um Halloween at the end of the month and um, throughout October is um, Black History Month in the UK. It's really important that we just really edu educate ourselves on what that really means for um, for us as individuals, how that fits into British history in general and how we can really use our knowledge and shape the future. Um, so I definitely encourage you to get involved in whatever way you can, support black um, owned businesses and communities. Um, and actually in keeping with the foodie theme, I have linked the um, website for the black farmer who is changing the face of British agriculture. He has just brought out some sausages, which I would absolutely recommend you trying out. Um, part of the sale goes towards supporting black um, charities, um, so it's it's just fantastic. Um, and also, if you're a meat eater, then this would be great um, to sort of maybe combine with my soup. Yeah. I'm just basically going to go through the ingredients here now with you um, and then we'll get into the kind of like how to make it in the next clip. Um, I also know that some of you um, are Spanish speaking so I'll do my best to um, include the Spanish names for these fruit and veg. Um, let me know how you celebrate Autumn Festival wherever you are. Um, Autumn Festival is not a major um, holiday here. It's a lot more sort of traditional, I guess, um, all to do with like revenue and feeding the, the poor over the winter and collecting the crops. And it, yeah, it, it's, it's more of an agriculture um, sort of festival. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd use it as inspiration for my recipe. So um, yeah, let me know how you celebrate it um, down in the comments below. Obviously, if you do make the soup, let me know how you get on. Um, okay, so the list of ingredients. Sweet potato, <laughs> um, which is batata in Espanol. Um, it's a great word. It's a great vegetable. It's not a, um, it's not a carb. So it's a great alternative to just the normal spud or potato. Butternut squash. I can't for the life of me remember what that is in Spanish. The same as with an onion, but I'll put them down as um, subtitles. Carrots, I've got two, you can use whatever you want. Manzana, which is apple. And then we get into more like our sort of spices and our flavours. I've got organic forest honey. <laughs> I'm fine with um, honey being in um, like cooking, but I'd never have it on toast. Cinnamon, which is a great flavour for this time of year, a great spice, um, and have this featurely in like Christmas 
recipes, so stay tuned for Christmas. Then there's nutmeg. Oh, I love it. If you're into like your Caribbean food, you'll know what this is all about. Um, yeah, it's fab. And then, last but not least, a vegetable stock. So there you have it. I think that's all I really need to say. I'll let the next clip do all the talking. <laughs> Yummy, 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 I got love in my tummy.